वेलकम टू मोहन क्लासेस इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट कोऑर्डिनेट जियोमेट्री इट इज फॉर 9th स्टैंडर्ड इट इज द इजीएस्ट चैप्टर वी गुड एबल टू कंप्लीट इट विद इन हाफ एन आवर ओनली द कांसेप्ट यू शुड अंडरस्टैंड लेट अस स्टार्ट हियर व्हाट इज कोऑर्डिनेट सिस्टम कार्टेशियन कोऑर्डिनेट सिस्टम The Cartesian coordinate system it specifies each point uniquely by a pair of real numbers called coordinates, which are the distance to the point from two fixed perpendicular lines called coordinate lines or axes. Here let us take two, three in the pair of real numbers called coordinate. How we have to represent this in the graph? This is called the Cartesian plane. So here, x. This we can call it as o or zero zero. It is origin. This is x dash. This is y dash. This the x o x dash is called x axis and y o y dash. is called y axis so this is the cartesian plane in this plane we have to represent the 2 3 2 means it is the first one represent the x axis the second one represent the y axis 2 so x axis 2 here and three points so here it is the point okay it represents 2 3 it is the perpendicular lines that means this is the perpendicular line from two from the point to x axis that is the distance from x axis is called y axis this this is y axis then the distance from y axis to that point this is called x axis okay here also you can call it as x here also it will be y so that means x 2 2 units and y 3 units so like this we have to represent 2 3 clear what is quadrant quadrant this is first quadrant this is second quadrant this one we will call it as a third quadrant and this is fourth quadrant there will be only four quadrants in the first quadrants you can see here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 all are positive similarly here 1 2 3 4 all are positive so first quadrant will be plus comma plus all positive x x axis positive and y axis positive what about second quadrant second quadrant here everything is x axis it is minus and y axis it is plus third quadrant both are x axis minus and y axis minus 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 what about fourth quadrant fourth quadrant x axis plus and y axis minus clear it is very very important first quadrant both x x axis and y axis positive second quadrant x axis negative and y axis positive third quadrant both are negative and fourth quadrant x axis positive and y axis negative clear let us go to the next here as i told before A pair of numbers x and y in a specific order. X at the first place and y in the second place. The same I told na. X, x axis in the first place, y axis in the second place. X, y. So, if is it equal? If this both are equal, two comma three and three comma two? No, it is not. equal so x y the coordinates will not be equal to y comma x entirely 
different both are different coordinates so this 2 3 we will call it as a ordered pair this 2 3 will be called it as a ordered pair ordered means the first one represents the x axis and the second one represents y axis so we are calling it as a ordered pair so here x o x is that here o is the origin it is x dash it is y dash x o x dash is x axis y o y dash is y axis here x coordinate there is a name for x coordinate whatever represents x coordinate we will call it as a abscissa what is abscissa of it like that you may get a question abscissa is nothing but x coordinate the distance from y axis to that point so these two comma three coordinates we will represent as a point okay suppose if, if it is p is a point i am going to represent actually means here this is the point right this is the point we can call it as p of x comma y so here x is two and y is three therefore what is two two is the distance from y axis to that point and three is the distance from x axis to that point this is a point okay here yeah. this is a point p is the point two three okay so the x axis what we will call we will call it as a abscissa this two is called as a abscissa and the three is called the ordinate okay what is the value at the center center means here zero both are zero right zero zero so the coordinates of origin is always zero zero clear let us move to the next now plot the points two three minus five four minus three minus two and five minus six in the cartesian plane so what about two three already you have done right two three here it will come right this is a point Two, three. What about minus five, four? Minus five, four. Here it will come. Minus five, four. Right? Minus five, four. Right? Then minus three, minus two. So both are. Negative minus three minus two, it will come here. Minus three minus two. What about this? Five minus six. Five is x axis minus six. Five minus six. Yeah. What about this two? Two is the abscissa, three is ordinate. Here minus five is the abscissa, four is ordinate. Here minus three abscissa, minus two ordinate. Five is abscissa, minus six ordinate. Clear? Try the for your homework. Try in a Cartesian plane and plot it. Try for yourself. Let us move to the next. Here, find the quadrants where the points will lie. Now we have to find which quadrant the point will lie. Here it is minus 2, minus 2, comma, plus 4. So plus, plus, first quadrant, minus, plus, second quadrant. So it will come in second quadrant, right? Then 3, minus 1, right? 3 minus 1 means positive and negative. Where it will come? It will come in fourth quadrant, right? 
plus minus understand this is first quadrant first quadrant means plus plus will come second quadrant means here what we will get minus comma plus third quadrant both will be minus and fourth quadrant what you will get it is third quadrant right fourth quadrant plus minus see here you see plus plus you can easily understand plus plus one opposite minus minus here minus plus here will that this minus will become plus plus will become minus okay so here what about this minus one comma zero so here minus one comma zero right so it is second quadrant so what about minus zero minus zero is also a plus zero only so it may be represent third also okay now let us take it as a second quadrant here then what about one minus two one minus two it will come in fourth quadrant right plus and minus what about minus three and minus five minus three and minus five both are minus right so that means it will come in third quadrant here yeah. so like this in practice plus plus first quadrant minus plus second quadrant both minus minus third quadrant plus minus fourth quadrant that's it thanks for watching uh, if you like this video please share it to your friends subscribe and don't forget to give a like thank you